Seoul SK Knights finally won a game with star Jamil Warney in the lineup, extending their overall win streak to seven games, beating the Moralco Bolts, 81-80. Warney led the way once again, scoring a team-high 31 points and adding seven rebounds to his line. The Moralco Bolts were down for nearly three-quarters of the game, even by as much as 15 points. But their resilience brought them back to within one with less than seven seconds to go. With memories of Chris Newsom hitting an impossible game-tying shot to send the game to overtime last time out against Ryukyu Golden Kings in Studio City Macau, the Bolts had a chance to complete another comeback to extend their fairy tale season. Chris Banchero was the player with the chance to play hero, but his pass to Prince Ibe was tipped by reigning KBL MVP Kim Sun Hyung, who took it the other way, securing the Knights' second EASL win of the season. Reigning KBL MVP Kim Sun Hyung has struggled mightily this season. The 35-year-old guard came into the game averaging just 8.0 points and 6.0 assists in two EASL games. On Wednesday, he started on the bench for the first time in the EASL season. Kim played just over 23 minutes of play and still struggled with his shot, going 3 for 8 for 37% from the field. Kim finished the game with 7 points and 5 assists but recorded the key steal that sealed the game for SK. Moralco Bolt's import Zach Lofton was impressive once again in the game. The swingman, playing in his third EASL game, scored a game-high 32 points on 57% shooting against the Knights. The American import got a scare late in the third quarter, as he crashed into the sideline photographer while driving to the basket. Lofton left the game momentarily before returning early in the fourth. Lofton was instrumental in Moralco's comeback attempt late in the game, as the Bolts outscored the Knights 23-19 in the final frame. Jamil Warney was the star once again in this one. The big man played all 40 minutes of the game, recording a team-high 31 points while adding 7 rebounds. While the former Dallas Mavericks center scored just two points in the fourth quarter, he was still the heart of SK's offense, dishing the ball to record a season-high six assists.